Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to Exotic Astrology. And today we have a special guest, very, very, very special guest. We have Dr. Dharmesh Mehta Ji with us. Uh, recently, he uh, turned 50 years uh, old and uh, I just messaged him in uh, Facebook that wish you very, very happy birthday. And then he responded with a thank you and he said, when can we do a recording? So I was very uh, enthusiastic to uh, talk to you, uh, talk, uh, see, and this is the first time we are meeting, and uh, we are very fortunate to have you, sir. And today we will discuss, or rather, he will speak on the Dashamsha chart. How do you read the D10? Why do you need the D10? What is the D10? What's the speciality? And how do you predict, you know, results? How to see the D1, D10, and D10 and D1? So, welcome to Exotic Astrology, sir, and please enlighten us. Thank you. Thank you very much. After a long uh, time awaited, we are meeting. So, thank you very much for making me your uh, platform. And uh, uh, we both are fortunate or the viewers are fortunate that we will be coming to know at the end of the session <laughs> who will benefit. So, yes, the uh, Samsha. Uh, uh, that is a Dasamsh, Dasamsha, which 10th Amsh, as like uh, we call as a Ravana, as a 10th head. So yeah. Here is the 10th part. <laughs> <laughs> so Dasamsha <laughs> is a D10, what uh, in the short form we say D10. So it is a 10. So it is D10 is associated with the Saturn. And we all know Saturn is uh, our deeds, is our yeah. uh, principal who judge everything. So that is why normally from D10 we always see the career. Normally people say D10 see the career. Now what happens, why this divisional chart has made, there is a history. Because uh, mm -hmm. every house has uh, uh, so many things to see. Like uh, from every house you will be able to see 8 to 10 or 12 items. Like second right. house, your relatives, uh, your organ, your family, your money, well, so many things. So, but you want to focus on particular one thing, then you have to go to that division. So, divisional chart is very easily way. First twelve. First twelve is directly related to that house. Like D2, second house, so well. D3, yes. first, D4, for house. Whether yes. you have rented house or this. D5, you have a child. So, likewise, this is all common. After D12, it is directly jumped to D16. Now, people, okay. at our time, there was no computer. So, we have to remember everything by fingers. So, what happened? They, our guru, uh, almost, uh, again, I pray, C.S. Patel, sir. He always say, you do calculation, 12 is a 12,000. Then again, go 1, 2, 3, 4. So, D16 is 4,000. Then okay. D20 is your 7,000. So, see this. And when you match that with the result, no, it is same. So D10 is a first cycle of a divisional chart. So as a first cycle, yeah. it is directly 10,000. Right. So it is only and only focus about your deeds, what you perform. Because 10,000 shows your political connection, it shows your position, it shows the government, it shows name, fame, recognition, father, so many things. But you want to particularly touch the career path, what he will do. See, many times he may say that I am a housewife, but still she is doing something. Yeah, so yeah, yes. Household yes. Work. So, her also D10 chart is active because she is making the home. Okay. So her mark is of food. So, likewise, the okay. divisional chart is very important uh, for seeing the minutely thing. When you don't able to read something, you use a binocular class. Right. Right. It's nothing but you are 10 times zooming that and reaching to the 10th house. So, that right. is the divisional chart. That is a D10. The sum chart. So, it is divided mm -hmm. uh, into the every 3 degree, the division of 3, because 3 multiplied by 10, so 30 degrees. Now, very, uh, maybe people say it's a secret, but it's not secret. It's a calculation, like D9 and D10. The difference between D9 and D20 is only a part of a 20 second. Yes. That has one division of a 3 minutes and 20 second. Here, exactly 3 minutes. Okay. Right? So, what is the diff, uh, closeness to D9 and D10 is that whatever, because D9 is your internal desire. 
whatever you internally desire, whether you have a performing things for that or not. So that is why it is always matching. If our viewers will check the D9 chart and D10 chart, chart five planets at least will be similar with ascendant. Sometimes hmm. you will find Vargotami, Vargotami, both the place. So it is ah. not a secret, but what you desire internally, D9, you will be able to achieve when you perform it. So every desire has its performance. That is why it's a close D9, D10. Now D10 directly how to jump in D10? It's uh, ascendant to see, is uh, which house to see? Again, Bhavartha Bhav. See, Parashara has only one niyam is created, is a Bhavartha Bhav. Mm -hmm. I many times say if this rule is not there, Bhavartha Bhav, we could have only one house. Because from one house you go to second, second to second, third to third. That is Bhavartha Bhav. So this is also Bhavartha Bhav. In D10 chart, you are not seeing the 10th house. It's a mistake. You don't have to see 10th house. It is already zoom of a 10th house. And again, you are seeing 10th house. In D10 chart, you have to see the 7th house. Oh, I see. Okay. 7th house will denote whether you will do job. See, there are three kind of work people can do. Yeah. And if you locate in the chart, they all are in same line. Even housewife, we can say it's a different, but they are all in the same line. Yeah. Now you see from 6th house, right? 6th house is the job, right? Just ahead of this is the 7th house. Just, just one step ahead is the 7th. So that is partnership. 6th house say under summons. Mm -hmm. Work under summons. That is we call it the job. 7th house is say not under with, with someone. So we call ah, it okay. partnership. Correct, correct. See, 7th house just above is, is a 10th house. Mm. Not under someone, not with someone, you are independent. So 10th mm -hmm. house shows what the independent work you do. If you are professional, if you are uh, uh, individual work, if you do business, see the 10th house. Mm. If you are doing job, 6th house. So the work has started from primitive age. So yeah. first, People was working for someone job. So six thousand. Then they started collaboration, partnership, mm. joint venture. So it is one step they have gone ahead. So just six above is the seven. Then they started why to work with others? Let me work. So he has go further. And there he rise. Ten thousand is nothing but the rise. See right. in uh, Chalita also, when we prepare Chalit, it is a dasam bow. They say, see the sun when it is in the Sabha, your chalit will be exactly on the head of your. The sun is exactly head of this. It's Correct. exactly midday, 12 o'clock. Correct. 12, 12, 30, the sun is here and it yeah. is placed in your 10th house. So mm -hmm. then, now sun is your head. So you are independent. So do. And if you do this 10th house, just see the above 10th house is the 11th house. That is desire fulfillment. Mm, so, correct. These are in sequence. So normally, see, people always start. Even my father has a business. If I join, I will join as a servant only. I will not join as a partner. I will not be treated as a owner. They say first learn this all things. Learn from all this. So six house. Everybody in their life start with the six house. A small girl helping the mother, six house. So you are under direction of someone. So in D10 chart, why we see D10? To have your independent work. What your account, <clears throat> see we all have our account. I have done something, you have done something, he has done this, everybody. So yeah. one book is there. Like uh, daily workers, they write, today three hours I work, today five hours we work. So we all carry our diary. That diary is D10. That diary is D10 where you write, I have done this work. I have done this one. Now, where to locate? It's to locate in D10, 7th house. So, D10, 7th house, why it is important? The Chandubai always say, hey, why you are seeing D10? He say, for career. Career is which house? So, we proudly say 10th house. So, then say, Dai, why you are seeing 10th house? See, 10 to 10, power to power. Okay. So 10 to 10 is a 7. So, in D10 chart, you are not locating 10th house, but you are locating 7th house. In my D10 video also, I said, look at your the 7th house of D10 chart. 
what he's speaking. It, uh, it shows the up and down in your career. And I don't know that people only rise and rise. They have a time. That time they fall down. So this uh, fall down is also seen from 7th house in D10. And there is a rise in your career is also 7th house. Now 7th house is very important. Now see the uh, construction of D10. Now construction of D10 says from D1. If you are uh, odd sign. Odd sign. 1, 3, 5, 7, 9, 11. <coughs> Right? This all are the odd side. Then you will remain in same D10. See, this is a secret. If you are in the odd side, suppose I am born in the Aries ascendant, okay? Then my D10 will be Aries. Okay. If I am born in the Gemini, my D10 will be Gemini only. Okay. So, this is a secret. Now, this only will come to us. Astrology is nothing but astronomy behind using logic. So astronomy is calculation. So I done the calculation. So Aries, the intent start with Aries. All odd. This is a beauty that all odd. Uh, uh, this uh, D ten start with the same. In even it is ninth. So it is only that ninth will apply. So if uh, my ascendant is Taurus, my D ten to start with the at Capricorn. Correct. So if it is uh, Cancer, then my D10 start with the Pisces. So it is 9. You have to see 9,000. So this is also a secret. If you are born in the odd sign, then you will be doing what you are seeing. See, D1 is what you are seeing. Yeah. That you are doing. See, you caught any child. You say, what you will become? I will become doctor. I will become pilot. He will become pilot if he is an odd sign. Okay. See, this is a secret. <laughs> what he see. He become okay, okay. What it <laughs> likewise we say, no, what we see, we become. Right? Yeah, that is yeah. The observation that is a manifestation or observation. What people say, so that is only odd sign having this secret. What they see, they become. So, if your son, your uh, relatives comes to you and say, What he will become, ask him, What do you want to become? If he's odd, <laughs> I want to become an uh, actor. He will become actor because he has decided. He's very strong from D10. Now, this is a calculation secret. That is a calculation. Now, what about the uh, even? Uh, even left. All even people will follow their destiny. They will follow their destiny. It's the ninth house. It's the ninth house. Okay. D10 start with the ninth house sign. Oh, okay. for example, Taurus, D10 start with the Capricorn. Correct, correct, correct. So they will follow their destiny. So even though I feel, no, I want to be, become doctor, but my destiny say I become engineer, I'll become engineer. So here's okay. the destiny. Okay. okay. Now this is a, uh, I don't know whether it has, it has to be known to others or not, but this is a real secret. That D10 Initially, from the ascendant only, you will come to know that what he is going to become. Whether he is odd, he has decided, he has seen, he has foreseen, and he will do that. But if he is even, you have to wait where his destiny starts. Okay. And many times it becomes, <clears throat> like I, I tell you that uh, in the childhood, I want to become a teacher. So Because so many people around me, our relatives are teachers. So I feel that it's a very powerful position. You can change. So, but uh, time has gone, and I become advocate, and uh, then. But again, I went to the teaching line and astrology. Also, I am teaching, and people see the says that you are a good teacher because it's a destiny. I am a even. <laughs> I am a even ascendant. So my destiny will lead to my work. Okay, so, got it. Somebody who's a odd ascendant, he what he see, he will take. You will take same. Mm. See, if the ascendant sign goes same, almost 10th house sign goes same. Mm. same thing. Yeah. So what he has seen is a first house that he will become. That is 10th house. So that is a secret for <laughs> uh, odd. And for <laughs> even, you wait till your destiny. <clears throat> you can see okay. his 9th house. So you 
will come to know his destiny is saying that you will become great. So basic concept is that uh, what your role is being made. Everybody's role is being made. I'm partner, I'm director, I'm uh, employee, I'm worker. This all designation everybody knows. Everybody is. That title you will come to know by detail. What title you will carry. Right? So one is a hierarchy 6 to 7 to 10 to 11. And this is the second that is a odd goes odd and even goes 9. So this two technically for only people utilize those. Their 80% uh, work has been done. Because you have done, see now uh, like uh, you know, uh, pizza. You yeah. know, we all know the pizza. The base is same. Only yeah. topping. Other than <laughs> <laughs> you like veg, somebody's like non veg, somebody's like this. Topping change. Yeah. Is, only toppings will change. So, this topic, uh, whatever is there, is the planet. Now, uh, like the, your, now what you have to carry from D1 to D10, and what you have to see from D10 to D10. We can only carry something from D1 only. We cannot carry from the regional chart. So don't be under impression that we uh, carry something because it's a larger uh, stock. D1 is a larger stock. From which something you can take and you can go to the divisional chart. Now our uh, guru says Rashi Tulya Namansa. This is as written in the Chandakala Nadi also. Rashi Tulya Namansa, Namansa Tulya Rashi. Now, Namansa means any divisional chart. You can speak okay. uh, Rashi Tulya Dasamsa, Dasamsa Tulya Rashi. Yeah. Yeah. And okay. ordinary people will see Rashi. Rashi means Lagna. Rashi Tulya Dasamsa. They will Correct. take El, every planet to the detail. The, our guru always say, don't follow the people. Follow the reverse trend. So, he say, carry D10 to D1. Because that there is a very limited... See uh, things you have to see. See from divisional chart, all house, all planet you have to carry to D10. It's a 12, 12, 144 combination. Whereas from D10, only five things you have to carry to the D1. So that is easy. Now people only want that uh, shortcut. So this is nothing but the shortcut. That carries something, small thing, which is very relevant, that you only carry. And see how it is played. So what you have to carry is five things. One is uh, your tenth lot, right? Ten. Tenth of mm. tenth lot. Okay, that you have to uh, keep in your basket. The tenth so lot of the D ten chart. D ten chart that you have to carry because see what happens. They all are a state. Like uh, in India, we have a twenty nine states. So he is a uh, chief minister of that state. He has to take to the center. He has to take to the Delhi. So likewise, the tenth lot of D uh, ten chart you are taking, then carry Saturn. The second most important in D ten chart is your Saturn. That you have to always carry because whenever is a ten, so Saturn. When we see D nine, we see Jupiter. So every mm -hmm. divisional chart has some planet uh, affection. So here the affection is with the Saturn. And that is why we see the career, deeds, everything from D10. So first we will carry the 10th lot. Then we carry the Saturn. This is the second. Then planet seated in 10th house. Okay. Whatever the planet seated in 10th house. Then 10th from Mercury. Now people don't see this. 10th from, 10th Mercury. from Mercury. Okay. What is 10th from Mercury that where your mind wants to work? Mind, Mercury. Yes. And See Mercury to 10. If you see Mercury to 10, no, he will lead. Your mind is working somewhere. Your oh. mind wish to work that side. See, many times you say, no, hey, shh, concentrate here. Why? Because his mind is going somewhere else. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah yes. else. And you are compelling him to work here. So, 10th from Mercury is your mind where you wish to work. See, it is uh, that is why relevant. If I give you some work which is not of your cup of tea, you will not do it. Yeah. Somehow you will wrap it and give it to me back. But there's no work has been done. You Somebody will pretend that he has worked. But there's no work has done. And again, you have to start from A4 Apple and Cup. So that is 10th from Mercury. It's also very important. And where it is seated. So this all five things 
is very important to carry from B10 chart. If these five things are in the appropriate position, which you are working sincerely, then okay. it's a say about it. Because tenth lord will guide you that uh, what internal. See, all divisional chart has an internal integral part of a D1. So whatever your divisional chart is there, it will show your internal part, internal thoughts like D9 internal intimacy. That is why marriage is being seen from D9 because it's a privacy. Is our private life. Like a yeah. D10 is your own internal desire to work. See, many, many times it happens that you are qualified for certain job. But when the real job comes, you cannot do this. Because you are not uh, uh, mean for that is not liking. You have done something, study, it's okay. But you are not. Many people in my life, I have seen PhD and very smaller people can't teach a simple topic. Why? Because they are scholar in the remembrance, but they can't scholar in interpreting. So that is a different thing. So tenth lord of your uh, D10 will show you what the internal things you want to work. Okay. What is your desire? Like if it is a son, we take a two three example. If your D10 tenth lord is son, that means you only want to order. You don't want to work. <laughs> you only want to order. So if he will be a sweeper, no, he, if he will be a sweeper, suppose one example, then he will order. I don't have a sweeper. I don't have a clothes. I don't have a what. So he will order always. He will not work. That okay. is his tendency. That is his tendency. See his tendency. If he is a moon, that if he, even if he is in army, no, he will be a good poet. Because okay. his heart is to poet. Many of uh, our army uh, the soldiers are very good poets. If you see the poet written by them, yeah. <laughs> because their soul, their work, their heart is speaking about the feelings. So this is a internal. That is a D10 10th law. So that will guide you what kind of a person you are. Mm. Now, many times you see a manager, a boss, is working like a hard work. Why he has to work? His CEO, is it? Because his 10th law is Mars. He can't sit. Okay. He can't sit in chair. You may see many seniors, many of your boss, you'll never find in chair. Mm. here and there. He's going to department, he's calling this person, going there and there. Why? Because his tenth lord is Mars. He can't sit. You want to fight, you want to order, you want to shout. So he will never find in his cabin. He will be always roaming. So this is the internal liking of somebody. So first of Touch with that. That's what is his liking. Then as I show, uh, told you, Saturn. Saturn will give you <coughs> a direction that I'll be working systematically or not. See, we all know that Saturn is a son of a son. Is a son of a son. So yes. how the son is disciplined, Surya, the same discipline goes to his son also, Saturn. Correct. And Saturn Correct. is more rigid in the making others worthy. Mm. So it is a compelling. We all know universally that office work is 9 to 5. Everywhere. Somewhere it is 9.30 to 5.30, but it is 9 to 5. So everybody has in mind that 9 to 5, this person will be occupied. Whether he's doing job or doing this is Saturn. This is okay. Saturn. No, planet seated in 10th house, which is influencing you. He's not allowing okay. you to work. See, uh, one of my video in the uh, empty house, I have done one video empty house theory. Whenever your house is not occupied by any planet, that is called pure house. It is not interfered by the sitting planet. So if your 10th house of a D10, any planet is seated, that means somebody is inter interfering in your work. Okay. Somebody will like to interfere. Whenever any house is not, see we have a 12 house and 9 planet. Obviously, 3 house will be empty. If you have two planets seated together, three planets seated together, then you are yeah. four or yes. five hours here. You make the interpretation of that empty house is a pure because no encumbrance of any planet. A sitting okay. planet is nothing but the encumbrance. He will say, no, no, go this side. <laughs> Why you are going this side? See, he is okay. manipulating you. See, he is not an owner. So Correct. he doesn't have any say. So he will interfere in your work. If somebody can't... Uh, Work like you know, you will interfere. So this sitting planet is nothing but 
who will going to interfere who is the obstacles in your and now again it's a planet only so your emotion is your obstacles your mm-hmm. ego is your obstacles your hard working is sometimes your enemies so that is sitting planet of d10 also being very equal and then 10 from mercury i already explained the 10 from mercury is a, a thought which you want to make in action right okay. so when this all are seated in the movable now we have only choice of a three sign the yeah. nature of a sign is a movable yes they, if it is seated in the movable sign that means your career will never be stable today you are doing job then you will do business business not successful again you are uh, doing job and then you are doing nothing. So it is always fluctuating. You will be never been instable. If it is uh, seated in the fixed sign, then it will be a stability. You uh, choose one, you retire with one. Means okay. If you are a banker, you will retire with the banker only. You will not end up with somebody else. So you are okay. in a straight line. You may be seen in the bank. Uh, many Parsis were, were, were working in the bank. They very young age they enter into the bank and they retire, then only they leave the bank. That is a fixed sign. So this is fixed. <clears throat> then dual sign. If this is seated in the dual sign, then initially you are in one work, but later on you will go to your real work. So initially you may be doing job, but your ultimate aim is there. See, many people say, I want to do business only, but let me learn for initial five, five, yeah. four, five years. I learn and then I'll. But he has focus. He's not a movable that he, he don't know. Movable means what who's not stable at all. He can't stay more than two years in one place. But dual is a combination of fixed and movable both. So presently he's in movable, but he has already seen himself to be there. See, many employees, when they enter into the organization, they have a visualization to become CEO. <laughs> yeah, okay. No, everybody cannot, but many. Yeah, many. yeah. And, uh, okay. and the autobiography where he said that I was a very initially a pun and then I reached to this position. So this all are a dual. And I always salute the dual ascendant. You will see all great people in dual. Like the okay. Bani, anybody. <clears throat> because wherever they today know. From nowhere, they will be somewhere. That is destiny. All dual, all dual ascendant have this tendency. So, and this now, one is, question I have just to confirm. So, all yeah. these placements that you are saying we have to check dual or movable or fixed, this we have to check in the D1 or in the D10. 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 Okay. Not touch anything of D1. Okay. O- only D10. we are only discussing D10. Okay. Perfect. Everything so, you have to see D10. See, you are going more closer to his liking of work. That individual, that person, what yeah. is his intention to work? Correct. So, when you assess this 10th lot of D10, is uh, Saturn in D10, is Mercury in D10, is uh, planet seated in D10, 10th house, this is all in D10. And 10 to Mercury, this 5 planet when you assess, then you will come to know which direction his mind is going. Okay. Now you have to check whether this will be suitable to his personality because personality is D1. Oh, Whatever time you go, see, you have uh, cooked the gravy now. Now yeah. gravy is ready. I say the base is ready now. Now you have to put either a vegetable or a paneer that your vegetable will end. So this is the main gravy. When okay. gravy is ready, you will come to know that taste will be like this only. So okay. If you add veg, you add non-veg, this all are the particles. Oh, so correct, correct, correct. Gravy create the taste. So taste you already know. That he is in taste of a business. Now he is doing job, means he is not reached to his place. Now that you already came to know that he is even. So even will reach to his destination. But odd what he has thought, he will continue with that only. He cannot change. So okay. This is the biggest uh, uh, secret it has lies in the ascendant itself. That what ascendant, see when ascendant fixed though, in your D1 or D10, any chart, any divisional chart when ascendant get fixed though, 
he is the main karta he is a main uh, leader he is a main king oh and i see he will only now you carry all these things and now come back to the earth now we'll focus in everything in the earth now okay. here you have created the gravy you are ready yeah. everything yes now you have to just add something that what his personality what his uh, uh, outer part is doing. you came to know about his inner part right now you are seeing in the main chart yes now in main chart you have to see for six house access the six house access the seven house access the ten house that what uh, three stages i said whether he is uh, familiar with the uh, uh, see when you are not using your destiny see destiny is jupiter then you are if your jupiter is weak don't apply your destiny <clears throat> don't okay. invest money don't uh, uh, utilize your ego and don't do partnership okay because your sixth and tenth karak is certain <clears throat> Correct. Your seventh karak is Jupiter. So if you are using your destiny, then only go to seventh house. But if your okay. destiny is not there, don't touch seventh house. You will lose by some money. So oh, if you are going to work independently or dependently, there are only two work: dependently six house, independently tenth house. Both okay. are certain. Both the karak is certain. Correct. Now whatever energy you brought from B ten chart, you have to see how they are placed. If they are placed in the well, Kendra, Trikona, Swagrahi, uh, own sign, exalted, that means you will reach to your work. There will be no hurdles. Now, main important is every divisional chart is the their six, seven, twelve lines. Every divisional chart. See, in main house when we are uh, threatened about the six, seven, twelve, we are fear about it that it is a malefic house, six house, eight house, and ten house. See, in our hand, we have a three holes. In my one of video, I see this. So this is six thousand. It is a second to seven. This is six thousand. This is eight house, and this is your because lifespan we uh, lifespan we see from here. So this is the eight house, and this is twelve thousand. You take somebody's water, take this, and take a water in his palm, and see from where first drop down. He'll do that. Okay, so interesting. So my uh, <laughs> this uh, water uh, remedy in two thousand fifteen, I've done one video with uh, Sapthari. Where also I have given the secret. You will come to know whether he'll do job, whether he'll do uh, business. Everything. See, you know, uh, Brahmins when they start puja, they do the sankalpa. Yeah, uh, sankalpa. Uh, they give you some water and some rice, and they say, "Okay, follow me." So he'll chant something, 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 whatever is there. He chant for at least two minutes. These two minutes slokas are whatever is there. It's not relevant. Relevant is that that after this he say kari shyami pani chodo leave the yeah. water. Yeah, yeah. Some if some nothing is dropped down, no? then he will realize that whatever karma you are going to do, it will not give you result. So Brahmana in the initial only come to know that whatever puja I am doing. You will not get any benefit. So this is a secret. Either it will be dropped from six house, or eight house, or twelve house. So this is six, okay. eight, and twelve house. Wherever the biggest gap is there, that will be the problem. Suppose one and two bigger, there is a gap. You will be doing job, and you will be always been sick. You will be always fall sick, and you will be not completing your duty. So there are so many secrets are there. But this all. Um, uh, one video can't be completed, it is, but we'll focus on our D ten only. So in D ten, <clears throat> seventh house. Now uh, D one, you are bringing all these things, and you are seeing whether it will be comfortable with six lot, or whether it is being comfortable. All these things. From yeah, D10, yeah, yes. What you are carrying, you are comfort with the six house, you'll be doing job. If it is comfort with the tenth house, you'll be doing your own work. So don't only judge from B one that what you are going to do, because okay. what you are doing. Suppose your father will force you. No, you will become engineer only. Okay, you will pass. You will do engineering. But somewhere your liking is of photography. Your liking is doing uh, uh, painting. Your liking is the swimming. You will go to swim. You will do that, okay. and yes. you will get medal in swimming, not medal in engineering. Oh yeah, yeah, yes, yes. 
So you see that lighting. Now we have a lot of choice. In early in my days, there are only few choices: either people become engineer, doctor, or accountant. This is all a very limited uh, choice that time. Because computer was not there, there were no uh, expansion. So you have to see all these five components: tenth lord of ten, D ten, Mercury, Saturn, planet seated in ten thousand, and fifth is your Mercury to ten thousand. <coughs> All five you have to test it with your B one chart, whether it is being familiar with the sixth house or whether it is familiar with tenth house. See, there are so many parameters that all we can't discuss. But one those who yeah. are astrologer who regular they know how it is familiar with the sixth house or tenth house. That work he like he will do. One day he will reach there only. Mm. So it is a. His destiny, because D ten is his ultimate work. What he likes from internal. Okay. And when you give somebody, if you give the uh, instrument to the person who loves the music, he will uh, play that instrument. Obviously, see if you like, then somebody's house. If you see harmonium, you will go and try to play because that is your liking. Why other is not attracting? Somebody who likes the uh, uh, cigarette, he will find. Oh, cigarette is there. He will take that only. He will not take any other thing. So it is our liking. Correct. Right. Now <clears throat> that was the one part. Then the most important part, as I said, that ten D ten chart seven thousand. Now we only focus D uh, ten chart seven thousand. What do we see? Now, if any benefit planet is seated, now we have only three choices. Either benefit planet will be there, either malefic planet will be there, either no planet will be. There. Only yeah. Choice. Yes. If there is a malefic and benefic both seated together, you have to see who is more powerful because both cannot be powerful. Yeah. Yeah. Powerful. Both cannot be. So either it will be a upper hand of a benefit. If in D ten chart seventh house benefit planet is seated, you have your own business. You will not listen anybody. You will do your business. You don't like somebody interfere. Somebody will direct you. Somebody will tell you do this, do that. You will have a difficulty. If malefic planet seated in D ten chart seven thousand, malefic planet D ten chart seven thousand, he will do secure work. He will do job or he will secure because he can't have a positive attitude. See, job normally you can't have a positive attitude. If you apply your positive attitude, he will fire. Mm. So you can, you have to make yourself positive. But you never have a positive. See all job who are doing job, no? they always shout. My boss is this. My company is this. My colleague is this. He never uh, appreciate. He will always criticize because it's a tendency of malefic planet. So if you are uh -huh. seven thousand of a D ten malefic planet seated, you will do job. You will criticize. You being criticized. You will also do criticism of others. He is doing this. He is doing this. That. And somebody also will criticize. He is not doing. It. So that is an idea of a malefic planet. Malefic planet always spread the rumors. That is a tendency of a malefic planet. Okay. And malefic planet, yeah, that is a tendency. Whichever house your malefic planet is sitting in, he will spread the wrong rumors about you, about that. Oh, that I is see. why we say second house Rahu. Your family will spoil. Who will spoil? Rumors. Okay, I see. Okay, makes sense. Yes. Who will spoil? <laughs> okay. Then God will come and say that don't be separate. <laughs> that is a rumors. People don't okay. the malefic and benefit. What the benefit planet? He will speak good about you. Oh, okay. Planet. What is the malefic? Planet? His mood is only malefic. See, you see the okay. devata, God and demon. What the work yeah. of demon is there to spread rumors? Yeah, yeah, gossip and yeah, yes, yeah. yes. So what the, that the same tendency of malefic planet is doing same. Now what we see, he is giving our hardship. He is giving us challenge. Are he is spreading a ignore it, and move on. You have an option. <laughs> so that malefic tendency of a planet is to gossip or spreading a rumors, spreading a negativity about it. Now that is only happen in the job and any secure work because those who are doing job 
they will <clears throat> never able to see others doing better to them. That mm-hmm. is the tendency of a malefic planet. What yeah, yeah, yeah. Why yeah. Rahu? See, Rahu has, we all know that Rahu has tried to drink the nectar. Right? Yes. Who has instigated, people don't know. Is a Saturn. Because Saturn and Rahu are a competitor. Both are malefic. Yeah. Both want to be a superior to each other. That is why Saturn okay. has instigated. Are you are very smart. Go and drink. You will become a Amar. Nobody will kill. Because he don't want him to be a competitor. Yeah, you are very scholar. Go and drink. So Rahu came in somebody's world and he has drink. And we all know the rest of us. So benefit, benefit never curse each other. Okay. Curse each other. That is a tendency. Okay. And that is a malefic planet tendency. Wherever okay. you are malefic, anybody, now all the viewers can see, wherever your malefic planet is there, he will try to spoil your things. So be aware. Okay. You always try. This is not good. This is see a fourth house uh, malefic planet seated will not get comfort out. Why? Because your neighbors are always spreading bad things about you. Oh, you will not I be see. Pleasant. Okay. That is not Makes that sense. my house is bad. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. Some uh, watchmen okay. will speak. Uh, don't go his house. Don't work in this place. So this is all the rumors around your pleasure. So I always see the malefic planets are the uh, rumor spreader who always try to make you down. So there is a challenge. So wherever okay. the malefic planets are there, if you see that things are uh, against you, just come out from them. That is a mal- uh, fighting about, about the malefic planet. You cannot turn malefic into benefit. How? If we can turn, God has done everything, but still there has not been turned. <laughs> All the malefic planet has not turned during the uh, time of God. How yeah. we can turn? Yeah, that yeah. Is myth, that is a myth that we say that uh, we will turn the negative malefic planet. If no planet, this is a third situation, if no planet seated in 10th house, he will be self-employed. He will not go for job, he will not go for the business. So only three kind of a work, what we call as a business, we call it as a service, we call it as a professional. So all the professional, we will find that uh, D10 chart, 7th house, there will be no planet seated, nobody is guiding, no guiding principle, no uh, focus of anything. He has his own detail. So this, that is why D10 chart 7,000 and D10 chart 10,000. Both are having a different dimension. One is indicating the uh, process of your work. That is 10,000. See, it will show you the process. What is liking to you? Okay. Core of your heart. Core of your heart. Inner voice is guiding you where? What okay. he wants to work for you. And 7th house will give you the format. That is the difference between the 10th house and the 10th, 7th house. So format is ready. Like a container is ready. Now you have to pour something on it. Pouring mm-hmm. from 10th house, the container is 7th house. In that context, if people can understand. So this 7th uh, uh, house of a D10 chart will give you a format. Which format you are going to work. So those who are always having a question whether I should go for the business, whether I should go for a job, whether I should be self-employed. Now see, now it's uh, uh, one of my videos also. I, say, uh, I have done in 2020 to one video. Uh, that is 2024, a year of transformation. Many people have said that why you have skipped 2023, but I have given the reason for 2024. And now we are seeing that reason. 2024 to 2044 is an era of a talent. Those having talent will survive. Those having knowledge, no place. Now, knowledge, you see, 2004 to 2024 was a knowledge era. All the master degree, everybody has done master, everybody has done PhD. Those early to 2004, nobody was doing MBA. 2004 to 2024, everybody is doing master degree, MBA. ME, MCOM, LLM, all master degrees started by 2004 to 2024 was the era of knowledge. So everybody has gathered the knowledge. Now how you turn knowledge into skill is the 2024. It has started. Now those will only survive who has a talent. And this is the D10 7000. That is talent. 
what kind is of there, a talent is is there any reason like why do you say 2004 to 2024 is uh... <laughs> yeah, that is an era that we call as an era every 20 years the land reform so the surrounding change so you now know, it is still for till 2044 okay. 20 <laughs> years you see 84 to 2004 as being you are in technology it was technic technology the era so all your computer and mobile came before 2004 now no yeah. new mobile has came no new computer only software change mm. only software change so yeah 84, 84 the television uh telephone then uh, mobile computer internet everything has been changed because that was a technical era that was we call as a seventh period so seventh period is the technology eighth okay. period is knowledge is a certain so knowledge so everybody has gathered you see in this 20 years we came to know there is a ib board there is cbsc board this is that board this board ib board so many board we came to know about education yeah. and that was really an education era. those who have taken the knowledge now see every era when change Prior to that uh, four years, there will be a reform. Now, when 2004, that time was going to change, in 2000, Y2K came. So, that system entire changed. In 2000, you maybe know, Y2K came that uh, all the 200 computer was not accepted. That is uh, oh. called uh, binary. In binary, they can't accept 20 together. So, that is why a big trauma is created in the uh, Silicon Valley. And that is why Silicon Valley has came. Because of this 2000, Y2K we call as a, and same four years before in 2020, the pandemic has came. So 2024, prior to that four years, now 2020 onward, everybody becomes skilled. Now see, everybody was at home, they have developed their skill. They got a time mm. to develop their skill. Yeah, yeah. And for another. Now who's uh, ruling uh, in USA, in all IT companies? Obviously, Indians only. Mm. Because they went in uh, 2000, uh, 99, 2000, they all went to UK, uh, USA and they saw Microsoft and everybody and things reform. So, this is a uh, this is a work that which you format, which format of a work you are going to see, uh, you are going to work will be D10, 7000. And what kind of work, what uh, liking, what uh, uh, for, uh, 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 talent kind of a work you are going to see is a detail. What is your liking and what is your container where you are going to end? So, this is a distance, and the distance between both are 10th only because it's a 10th uh, detent chart. So, many times, why it has not been directly written, why it is only being uh, given by the Rishi Muni only, otherwise, everybody will come to know. Mm -hmm. That is why they have given in the secret code. Now, you will say, then, why you are disclosing? See who. Out of uh, lakhs of people who will see our video, yeah, Achha, many people will see video. Will see that uh, fifty thousand, one lakh, two lakh people will see. Who will understand this? <laughs> Ten percent, twenty percent. Sometimes when you listen, to you catch something. Oh, this is idea. Sometimes after listening two hours, also you'll be like, okay, it's normal. Why? Because that doesn't uh, catch your. Uh, antenna. Mm. So here, uh, stability in career, job, business, profession. This is the main thing. And people, half of our, I think, uh, seventy percent people don't know where they have to end up. They don't know about their career where they have to end up. They are doing job. Yeah. They are criticizing job, but they don't have dare to work uh, do business. Mm. You think that those who are doing job, no, they criticize. Uh, this is bad, this is bad, boss is bad. This is... He said, why don't you start your business? No, 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 I can't start. And why you are thinking this? <laughs> because your 10,000 is something different than your 7,000. Your 7,000 okay. show you the format. So first, select the format. I always say the people for select the format. If your format is being fixed, so now you'll like that. If I come to know that I can do only job, I have no other option. I'll do better in job. Mm. I know that I my liking, my format is business only. Even yeah. today I'm doing job, I have a hope. I have a, a faith that I am going to end up with the business. And he will. 
because he's in D10, he can change. He is D7, he cannot change. The format is which is been made, you cannot change because that is the format for everyone. Out of all world people, they are only into this. Now you see beggars. The worst of a work people think is the begging, right? Yeah. Actually, they are self-employed. They have talent. <laughs> okay. They have a talent, no? One can sing. Yeah. One can do something. See, even you want to ask a pen, you will sometimes shy how to ask in pen. Yeah, yeah, begging, yes. Begging is very difficult. <laughs> it's a hardest job. People think that it is a last recourse, but this is very hard job to back mm -hmm. on. Please give me some. It's uh, uh, out of your uh, uh, this. Uh, how much courage you want to back something from other? So that is a uh, format. That is your you are self-employed. Beggars never work under some. Beggars mm -hmm. don't do the business. So they are self-employed. They yeah. are talented. So now you will find more. Now what happened that as the era change, no, I've seen, uh, because almost it's uh, 35 years, I've seen the three phase of books. 84 to 2004, 2004 to 2024, and now 2024 onwards. Those child come, those career people come. I see that everybody has uh, D7, uh, D10, 7,000 empty. Now they oh. all are going to become self employed oh. I've seen many chart. Means, uh, it will only happen when your D1 chart, uh, planetary position or something. Then only D, uh, 10 chart, 7,000, no planet is there. So now if you see the D7, uh, D10 chart, 7,000, you'll come to know that which format is brought. First, look at the format. I will give you the hint. The first, look at this format. Because only three formats are there. If somebody is having the fourth or fifth format, please write in the comment box. Okay, I have found this format. It's only either you work under someone, either you work with someone, either work you independent. What the other format you can say? Even if you have 100 partners, it's a partnership only. Yeah, yeah, yeah yes. Partner. If you are doing alone, you are doing alone only. You are not interfering others. And if you are doing job, you are always under someone. That is the format. So format first you fix. Then you see what your liking is there. Liking is P10 chart. That I like to order so he will do mm. that work i like okay. to only communicate see in your office also if you are working you came to know that somebody is only talk they don't work because their mercury is powerful they are very good in talking oh. and if you find your boss mercury powerful then he will catch everything of you whatever good idea will go and tell him that is why this is a precaution for all the employers <laughs> if your boss is having a mercury powerful now, you will say that how I will come to know my boss, Mercury is powerful. I don't know his chart. If you know how much he talks, if he talks beyond the level, beyond the capacity, his Mercury is powerful. That is a small clue. Somebody when speak more than, if you designated somebody, you know, you are going to speak for uh, five minutes. If you speak within three minutes, his Jupiter is powerful. If you speak exactly on the five minute, his Mars is powerful. Is okay. powerful. okay. And if you go beyond five minutes, one second, his Mercury is powerful. So, by talking only, you will come to know <laughs> that uh, okay. if his Mercury is powerful, don't give him idea. Never give him idea. Okay. Knows it all. Ah, he'll catch your idea. Ah. And he'll produce. Okay. So, and most of in job, People face this problem. They share something with their colleagues or their boss, and they will take that things with their name, and okay. you'll be there. Your ideas will be utilized by someone. So, like Jupiter, if your boss is always involving you in the work, you will say, okay, if you are there, what decision you will take? Maybe his boss are allowing you. You'll see in the team they allow you. I say, what you will take decision? What you? This is Jupiter is powerful. He wants to take a joint decision. And that he will carry also. My team says. See, he will represent that my team is saying that we should take this project. Otherwise, if he's Mercury powerful, he say, my team is not working. I got this idea. Ah, okay. 
will come to also see the for, uh, format first and then see what is liking of it. This all liking is in the 10 chart, 10,000. That what his tendency. Okay. His tendency is just to enjoy. See, many people enjoy their work. Whatever work you do, no, uh, give him, no, he will do. You say, oh, you have to do this. Okay. You have to travel tomorrow. Okay. He will always ready. He is very nice. So he is enjoying his work. So every planet is his tendency. You don't see the tendency of a planet. See, that tendency of planet, you will come to know D10 lot. Who is your D10 lot? That is your tendency. That is your liking. That is your talent. That is your inner things, which you want okay. to explore. So if you give that person into that, I am I am in the free company, I am an advisor, where they say that which role should be given to this person, which role. So I always advise, don't give him a boss thing. See, okay. he has to be, but he will spoil the organization hierarchy because he will always jump and go to the upper things. That is a Mercury tendency. Mercury always like to jump. And that is why Mercury always says, to whom we sit, it takes the role. We say, no, if it's seated with the benefit, you will get the benefit. Yeah, the yes. That is a tendency. Learn from this. To whom he sit, he will absorb and he will produce himself. Okay. So okay. You have to bury the character. And uh, one of, in my Mercury video, I said, if Mercury is alone. See, in our many verses, they have given uh, two lines. Mercury is seated with malefic planet. Mercury is malefic. Mercury yeah. is benefit. It's a benefit. What about if Mercury is seated alone? <laughs> they don't want to state that thing. That is why they hide it. Many things is say read between the lines. Now read between lines says if Mercury is alone, you can't imagine. You can't imagine okay. what he is going to do. So. Many times we say that don't trust the people who have no single mercury. Because he will not, he will agree with you, but he will disagree with others for you. So okay. you can't know which side his mind is going. That is why uh, in the Shastra it is say if it is seated with the benefit, it's benefit, seated with malefic, malefic. If it is alone, that we have to read, which is not written. If it is alone, don't even image, can't image what he will do. See, if you are sitting with me, you will discuss with me astrology. If you are sitting with uh, somebody else, you will discuss with me. But if you are alone, <laughs> may I come to know that what you are thinking? Say, hmm. Mercury is alone. Nobody can guess what he is doing. So okay. that is uh, Mercury. And Mercury, that is why specifically in D10 chart, Saturn is to be seen. Those who really want to work, Saturn. Okay. Those who don't want to work, only and only uh, speaking, only and only spreading the things is Mercury. So, okay. whether you are going into the spreading news or you are really working. So, that is only two. That is why I say 10th Lord, Mercury, Saturn. Planet is seated in 10th house. Now, planet seated in 10th house always corrupt you. We oh, are the, your worst enemy. See, we can see the far enemy, but we can't see the close enemy. The same thing when planet seated together. See, that is why in Panchada Maitri, planet seated with the planet is considered enemy. Oh, you know? yeah, yes, yes, yes. Why? Are you are saying Yuti. You are saying Yoga. Yeah. Is enemy. Why is enemy? Because he is sharing your house. That is oh, enemy. it's okay. <laughs> so simple they have made this uh, by using some uh, logic you will come is sleeping with your bed is your enemy. Right? So, okay. <clears throat> here also both are enemy to each other. Mercury and Saturn in D10 chart. You have to see he is a Saturn person, he will work. He is a Mercury person, he will only spoil. He will not work. And many offices, some bosses, if you find bosses of Mercury, he will spoil all that. And when he will retire or when he will leave, Company will grow. Okay. So, that is a tendency of a Mercury that not to work and not allow to work. See, he will kill your time also. You will say that, uh, sir, we will go in this direction. We'll do. You don't have anything. You don't have a say. Go this side. 
you will go this opposite side you will not find result again you have to come back mm -hmm. so that time has been spent that is the mercury there is saturn is there is a highly disciplined person See, okay we plan the discipline first of all is the sun yes like a sun you see 645 when you see 645 sun is there right so sunrise yeah sunset when you say 1840 sunset is there you see okay. 1840 darkness comes saturn is regular so these both are regular sun in the morning sunrise saturn in the sunset when the dark comes they both are regular so this two planet is a highly disciplined and right. third who make you discipline is mars see he oh. himself is not disciplined he make you discipline okay. sun myself i learn i have to get up early i have to sleep early saturn i have to complete this work in this time i have to complete this work in that time this is a work wise discipline sun is a bodily wise clockwise clock or body clockwise whereas mars is a discipline from others he expect discipline to be followed by others so this right. three discipline planet if placed well in detail chart you are always focus in your work whether you do format of business whether you format as a job or you see many business people don't entertain you after 7 o'clock you say no shop is closed will not yeah Why? discipline person and mm -hmm. somebody at 10 o'clock also if you say are you will give this you say oh come this time because he is not a discipline so you have to make him discipline so this all are the very short short technique which is associated with detail chart so two channel now we'll revise just the sequence wise what you the viewers have to see so d10 chart first we have to yeah. take the d10 chart because the the sum tulya rashi only you have to see so in d10 chart your 10th floor d10 chart your saturn d10 chart your mercury d10 chart your planet seated in 10th house and d10 chart your mercury to 10th house which planet is that so this mm -hmm. five planet you have to see this five planet how associate with your d1 chart whether it is associate more closer to 6th house job more closer to 10th house independent business then d10 chart 7th house in d10 chart 7th house you have to see whether benefit planet is seated own business malefic doing job and no planets it is you are self uh, talented like sports like actors they are self talented they use their skill so yes. you are skilled at your profession so these are the small things you have to see and most likely d10 7000 uh, is your format of work and d10 chart 10000 is your liking to work this two differentiated person will understand no? what format i have to work and which is my liking so when you associate these two it will become a form, form career for you now mm -hmm. only dasha will play its role while there's uh, all five associate things dasha will come that time it is a actual time where you perform better many people get it it's very early age somebody by 22 25 become famous somebody will get 40 amita bachchan got at uh, 48 so everybody has its uh, age mm -hmm. but that doesn't mean that you are started by 48 you are started by 24 only yeah, yeah, yeah. By so where you will be highlighted like when you will be uh, come into a picture that your dasha will decide but what kind of a work what format of a work what is your liking that all bits in from the chart so chart is always better to see the long term prospect whereas dasha is only for that particular period oh. in this period what format you will be going what challenges you are going to whether it is a benefit whether it is a malefic so <laughs> this is all about the d10 chart ah one more uh, that secret that uh, even uh, destiny and odd own desire that also mm. one is to remember that if your ascendant is the odd sign then you will be following same and if your mm. ascendant is even you will lend to your destiny so there's also one part which I have to share. Thank you so much. I mean, it was uh, we we uh, I've heard about the Shamsha before, but today it was like uh, X-ray. <laughs> <laughs>
and whenever i was try to touch with the logic why it is said i always have a question why it is said so i go reverse and then i come back with the reason that because of this it is said like this and that's what astrology is you know logic and astronomy it's like you know combined <laughs> Well, thank you so much, uh, Parmesh ji. It was a great pleasure to record with you and talk to you for the first time. We talked for a long time before even we started recording. Yes. And uh, you were telling about all the great astrologers you had met, like in your eighties, nineties. You know, it it was always incredible to hear. And I'm sure everybody who is watching this video is aware of who you are. But just in case. If you are not aware and you are watching this video and you are wondering who this person is talking from so long about the D10 chart, then I will pin his YouTube channel down in the description section and you all, he also does consultations, right? So if you want to have a D10 analysis, uh, watch this video first. <laughs> if you can understand and do it yourself very well if you can't then you can always go to him you will find his website and uh, email everything uh, down in the description section and at the end please send your good wishes to him and if you want to see further more similar videos uh, then please let me know on which topic would you like uh, Dharmesh ji to speak uh, and then yes we will we can get together again and we'll try to record it again so please write it down in the comments your feedback is very valuable okay thank you so much dharmesh ji great to talk to you and then see you soon again then yes anytime, anytime. thank you very much thank you